So you want to be a whiz at TV interviews. Well, guess what? You've come to the right place here at Otter PR. We can help you. I'm Ryan Bass. I've spent the last decade plus as a TV anchor and a reporter broadcasting locally as the main news anchor for CBS in Tampa, but also nationally on CBSSports.com. I've covered everything from presidential elections to Super Bowls, so I know what you need to do to make sure you nail that next TV interview. Okay, not to be extreme, but I want you to get that personal connection between you and the viewer, and that's why eye contact is so super important here. You can't be looking off to the side, so if you're doing this, it's gonna be distracting for those that are trying to get your key message and, and engage with you, uh, whether it be on television or any other medium. That eye contact is really, really gonna be key. Let's say you're doing it over Zoom, though, and you're not doing a, a physical interview with somebody, you still wanna be able to be looking at the screen and addressing the hosts or the viewers. It's just that way you can make a personal connection and they feel a little bit more connected to you while you're doing that interview. Number two, you wanna make sure your wardrobe and your background isn't distracting. You don't want anything taken away from your interview and your time there on camera to explain your key messages and get your product out there. So if you're dressing up for your on-camera interview or you're doing it at home, make sure your background looks clean and crisp and make sure your dress is solid colors if you can. You don't wanna do a lot of patterns because it can be very distracting on television. So making sure that your wardrobe and your background is looking nice, crisp, and pristine, that's gonna be key. And last but not least, be warm, be welcoming, and to the point. I wanna to get to know you. I wanna see your personality. I wanna see that smile. That has to shine through in those TV interviews for that viewer and that host to be able to get to know you, to be able to know your product. They wanna have that personal connection with you. And it's also important to be concise. In these TV interviews, you're limited on your time. You're not gonna have this long-winded opportunity to tell your story. So make sure you speak in sound bites. That way it's easy for the viewer and the host to understand, and that way they can continue to ask you those questions and get through that interview. You don't wanna to be too long-winded. You wanna be concise and straight to the point. And that, my friends, is just a few tips on how to nail your next TV interview. We've got plenty more to go over. If you need media training or you want help nailing your next interview, we are here to help. Just make sure you click the link below. Can't wait to get started.